97-1. Gloomy day out today, but hey, football's back tonight. Very excited. We've got deal breakers coming up in an hour at 4 o'clock. Jim Costa sitting in for Mike today. And I, I disclosed something off air to David, to Kenny, and you guys looked at me and said, get some help. You said, we need to have an intervention. We need to bring this on the air. We need to have this talk. Yeah, Rico, let me explain to you what this man is doing, okay? You know what best ball is in fantasy. You draft whatever player, and, you know, week to week, whoever has the most points, whatever, helps your team score. This man has 60 best ball fantasy teams. Wait, 6-0. 6-0. He has an entire spreadsheet with everything, all the information, all his players, Stats, everything he needs. And this, as I I think, is the worst part. His wife seems to be very uncomfortable with everything that he's doing here. And I don't blame her because it was 60 as of yesterday. It's 62 today. He added two more. What the heck, man? Who has this? Let let me explain, explain a little bit of what this is for people who have no idea what best ball is. So basically, you draft your, your team, you set it and forget it. You draft your team, they, you don't set a lineup every week, they just take your highest scoring quarterback, your highest scoring running backs, receivers, etc. And these are like million dollar contests. You can draft them starting in June. And I got a little excited for football season and maybe a little carried away. And I've, I've got 60 fantasy football teams, 62 as of so today. So you set it and forget it, meaning if tonight somebody goes down in the Hall of Fame game, like and I got Zamir White. I got a lot of Zamir White. He's going to play tonight in the Hall of Fame. He game. goes down. He's injured for the year. Then I'm out of roster spot. We draft benches and everything, so I'd be out of roster spot. You understand this man had not just 62 teams, 62 different drafts. He sat down at his computer 62 different times. You can do it on the phone. Wait, wait, wait. Or on his so, phone. So you just don't pick the people. You actually draft yeah, yeah, these are, these, folks. Yeah, these are drafts. These are 12-team leagues. Oh, cookies. They, 30 seconds a pick. You, you, My wife sat down and she did the math. She goes, how long does the draft take? I said, I don't know, like 45 minutes to an hour. She goes, you, you spent 45 hours cookies. drafting fantasy football teams. They haven't played a game yet. I, Not a single game has been played yet. It started okay. in June. Let, let, me, let me help you out here. Kenny, you know how I always say don't be Roberto. Cookies? Yes. This is the verge of having a marriage like Roberto. Right here. Okay. Cautionary tale. You're spending way too much time doing this. You just married your beautiful bride. You may want to spend some time with her. Go on another trip. Thank you. Take her out to dinner. We still go out what, to dinner. What? This what? isn't the only thing that I've done. While he's the... on his phone drafting you're, you're another four, team. Hold on. Pick 32 is coming up 45 here in a hours? Come on. But that's over two months. That's a work week. That's over a work but week. But that's over two months. These, they, they take 45 minutes. You can crank one out here a little after lunch special. You take a team and... No, you're not. You're not. And this is not good. You got 62 already and we haven't played... I'm tapering Football. off. I'm going to taper off. So you're not even accounting for players who just kind of come from nowhere and get high. You're so so it's kind of no, like no, no, the no. stock market. No, no. Let me say this: I'm buying 60... low on some guys who I think could pop big, 40... and I'll take the risk that some guys get hurt. Forty-five hours, yeah, on the draft. How many more teams are you going to have by no, the no. first How day of the season? How many hours in research did you do? Thank you. Thank you. No, no comment. Thank you. Oh, no. Couldn't you just build an extension to the catio instead? You're right, Rico, because we're just talking about the draft itself. Right. We're talking about he's not going into this draft cold. He, he's he got some stuff. Sail blue into cot steel. We're, I, this guy right here, I'm telling you, he's going to be Amon Ross St. Brown. Nobody knows about him. Give me him. I got a lot of Jalen Tolbert. He's my most owned player. This People is not want something a little to be proud Dallas of. Dallas Cowboys receiver. Gallup's hurt to start the year. I... Rico, I got him back before people were big on him. I got a lot of George Pickens, David's guy. Well, because... Out of Pittsburgh. This is before he wowed at camp. See, this is this is buying low on some of these stocks, basically. Like I can give you ownership numbers of how, what percentage of these drafts I got George Pickens. What percentage I have Jalen Tolbert. We're ready to go. I'm See, worried about the... you. This is the problem because Tim Patrick, Broncos wide receiver, hurt a couple days ago. I have a couple Tim Patrick. He Patricks. immediately tells me, 
Well, it's going to be great for KJ Hamler, and I wonder if I can grab him. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah. When he I saw this on teams. the sheet, I'm thinking, okay, fantasy football, like maybe he's in like three leagues. Nah, Jim, that's a little bit too. 62? and You're, you're going to do more of these, aren't you? Here's here's a some of the spreadsheet right here. These are just raw drafts. How many people are in this? How many other loose? I mean, other owners are there? You do. You, <laughs> <laughs> David just told me that he was in like three or four leagues yeah. usually a year, and I, regularly I'd think, I oh mean, that's that's a little much, don't you think? Now that seems perfectly reasonable. Right. These aren't, hold on, these aren't like regular leagues. These aren't like you're setting a lineup every week or you know everybody in the league. You're you just have drafting to, them. You put forty five hours of just. Time. Yeah. Not including research time. Mm -hmm. This is worse. Because at least in three or four leagues, you know the people, you're sitting around, you're eating wings together, you're joking about last season. You don't even know these people. How many fantasy leagues is too many leagues? And I'm t if hey, you keep this up, you'd be taking advice from Roberto. Oh boy. Is there a Probably number a to call? couch to sleep on? <laughs> Right, call the, call some number. Just pick up the phone and randomly dial something. <laughs> so I need how about, help. How about call your wife? Spend some more time okay. with her. I, 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 no, you know, what, you know what this is? You know what this is, Kenny? She's saving it all up. She's banking these hours that he's spending. And she's going to say, you know what? I feel like doing this. And he's going to be like, whoa, whoa, what are you doing? Whoa, remember all of those drafts you were in? Don't you dare talk to me. Go in the kitchen and make me some cookies. Leave me alone. I, I'll, I'm leaving. I'll be back when I get back. I'll admit it's a little excessive. It may it may have started out thinking I'll just do one or two as you know I, football season's going to be here, and then you start looking into more football, and I don't know. It's fun to draft a team. So what's worse, sixty-two fantasy leagues or building a catio? Two four eight five three. The roast of Jim Costa. <laughs> <laughs> Let me ask you this. Yeah. In the process of building a catio, were you at all using your phone to draft no, the team? No, no, no. I don't. I hold, hold on. I, I don't even know why I feel the need to defend myself, but I need to say this because I know I'm being judged very harshly right now, not just by the two behind the glass or, or Rico. The guy who won the million-dollar contest last year drafted his team in June. Before the hype, bought low, got his team, and won a million dollars. So there is some strategy to drafting at some, early. At some point when you were with your wife, did you stop whatever you're doing and say, whoa, whoa, I'm up, I'm in queue, I got to draft. You know, I 30 only get, seconds to pick, it goes quick. I only get blackout drunk on the weekend. That, doesn't, that means I don't have a problem. <laughs> like, I don't have a problem. He wanted it too. Do I have a problem? Does Jim have a problem? Pro probably. Probably. Hey, you know what? I'll let the people decide. 248-539-9797. Maybe David, Kenny, and 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 myself were just being too hard on cookies. We'll let the people decide because, yeah, I honestly I thought you were going to tell me you were in like four, five fantasy leagues. Yeah, that's a little bit too much. I still have the two I'm in, the normal leagues, right, where you you have your, your friends, you know everybody. And, so, do you even enjoy football, or are you constantly angry and happy at the same time? You're like the Schrodinger's cat. Of football, like <laughs> yes, he scored, but okay, that also hurts me. Right, in thirty-eight leagues. That I have, in. Well, that's why you have the sheet, so you can look and see who you have the most ownership of, and twenty-two percent. That's why like you happy. have the sheet. Nobody yeah, else has this sheet. Twenty-two <laughs> percent of me is happy that I just scored this touchdown. I, I, I did say that, like, oh, that's why everybody's got their, you know, Excel and Microsoft yeah. sheets where they've broken down. Okay, yeah, this is a little much. See, that's he had to buy extra cloud space to store the document. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, the people who play the multiple leagues, that's why I stopped because I found myself not enjoying because I, you eventually have that player that, okay, you can score one touchdown and get 140 yards. But anything after that is going to hurt me. But if you can fall into that small, narrow margin. If I can get Rodgers to throw a touchdown pass, but not to his tight end right. because I'm going against the tight end. No, no, not the tight end. No, no, no. You need to throw it to the backup running back. Yeah, I got a lot of A.J. Dillon. Nobody has him. A.J. Dillon, one of my most owned players. He's going to have a big year this year. I realize I'm digging myself a bigger hole. Listen, we all cope without football differently, and I may have stumbled into a bit of a problem. 248-539-97. 
yes, a bit of a problem. Okay. And then Rico, your question's a good one. Like how many fantasy leagues is overkill beyond what I'm doing? Like for 